now to Eric Fisher, the chief meteorologist at our CBS station, WBZ in Boston. Eric, where's this headed? Well, Scott, the last time a storm Category 3 or stronger hit the United States, Twitter did not exist, iPhones did not exist 4,000 days ago. That's a record streak, but sadly, it looks like that may end. Matthew is strengthening again tonight. It's moving off toward the west. We have hurricane warnings that extend across a large portion of the Florida coast and tropical storm warnings that are farther inland, and they also extend down toward the Keys. And here's a look at some of the potential wind gusts as we head through the next couple of days. As we head into Thursday evening, stronger winds starting to approach the coastline already very destructive winds across the Bahamas. So we head into the overnight. Look at the winds now gusting over 100 miles per hour at the coast, and they'll work their way up the coastline. Big thing here is where exactly will that center go? If it's inland, it brings all that most destructive wind inland. If it stays just offshore, 20 miles can make a big difference here, Scott. And this will move toward the Carolinas by the weekend. And it could still strengthen. Eric Fisher, thanks very much.